Hey, my name is Kowei Chen and my metrics number is 263027. I'm here to giving a speech with the title of Why We Dreams. Why do people dream? What is the meaning of dreams? And what impact do dreams have on people? Dream experts, psychologists and neurobiologists have been struggling for this for thousands of years. But they have not yet been able to find the solutions to this. Dream is a state of consciousness an experience that came after falling asleep. The length of the dream varies from a few seconds to 20 to 30 minutes. On average, humans have 3 to 5 dreams per night and some people may have more than 20. As sleep enter the middle of the night, dreams will become longer. So basically, the probability of a person not dreaming is very low. When he wakes up, he feels that he is not dreaming and may just forget the dreaming process. Most dreams are forgotten immediately or within a short period of time. People who are awakened during REM sleep are more likely to remember their dreams. In a complete sleep of 8 hours a night, most of the dreams occur in the REM sleep, which is usually 2 hours. The core actor of the neural relevance of dreams, Dr. Francesca Sicari, pointed out when you dream, the experience is very similar to the experience of waking up in many ways. You can hear and see and you can feel emotions. The experience in the dream is very realistic even though it only exists in your imaginations, but the experience is real. So there are three reasons of dreaming, which is process the information and memories, find resolutions, and third is coping mechanism. Firstly, dreaming help processing information and memories. Research has supported the claim that sleep is the basics for the good functioning of the brains to processing the information and memories. However, some scientists assume that the fact for the memory integration is not based on a couple hours of rest, but it depends on our dreams. During the day, we experience many things, and our brain needs to record, monitor, and record everything that happens around you. No matter whether you are conscious or unconscious, especially the amount of visual information is large. When you sleep, your brain will play back while playing back while organizing then put it into different functional circuits of the brain according to different contents furthermore most dreams include recent experiences and incidents that we have witnesses you may have thought of a car accident last week or you may have been dreaming of a weekly ride to the grocery this dream may be the conscious and unconscious stimuli your brain processes and organized throughout the day. After consolidating daily memories in brains, the brain has the opportunity to renew itself in a sense. Dreams are the way the brain restart the system, or we call reboot the system. The second reason of why we dream is to find resolution in dreams. The last thing you want to do is sleep if you are stressed about a particular challenging problem, right? But in fact, you may just want more. The beneficial effects of sleep and dreaming on memories have already stated just now. But dreams can help us solve problems in our daily life as well. For example, German chemist Friedrich Kekuler fall asleep in a chair and dream of a snake eating its tail. Inspired by the dreams, he discovered the ring shape chemical structure of the benzene molecule. This is a true story that the dream actually helped us to solve problems that we can't sometimes. When encountering obstacles, we mainly use known information to solve these problems. Dream is especially useful because it helps to arrange and organize memory as we solve problems making it easier to reach. Some researchers have also indicated that the brain will continue to address the problems of our waking life while we sleep.
and continually try to figure out the answers and ideas. Therefore, always keep working hard if you face a particular difficult problem. Probably, it could help. Periodic table is the important element in chemistry, but do you all know how this table came from? In the past, chemists only knew there were 63 chemical elements and there were no rules among these elements. Medley, a Russian chemist trying to find the regularity and unity among those elements. One day, Medley was so tired that he fell asleep on the desk in the studio. In the dream, he saw a periodic table of elements suddenly appear in front of him. This is how origin periodic table came from. This is why people say that morning is the time to study, because morning is the time we just waking up. Our brain is ready to absorb new things. And sometimes we might find out that the questions or problems that you cannot solve last night become simple and easier to solve in the morning. This is because you might find the solutions of the questions or problems in the dream that you have been forgotten last night. Now, let us continue to my last point, which is coping mechanism while dreaming. The dream can become significantly different when faced with stressful circumstances, often expressing your inner feelings. The dream attempt to create relevance to cope with inner conflict by showing significant symbol and questions relevance to waking life. Dr. Ernest Hedman, professor of psychology, stated that dreams are influenced by particular emotions such as fear and depressions. Different feelings constantly weave new material into the memories of the dreamer, helping him or her to deal with stress, anxiety, and other psychological trauma forms. On the other hand, the well-known psychologist Kao Zhang claimed that even the most imaginative dreams are a means of compensating for occurrences. From the perspective of psychoanalytic psychology, the meaning of dreams lies in the satisfactions of desires. No matter if you are a noble person or a humble person, the deep layer of our soul contains too many desires that we are willing to speak and unwilling to speak. Many of these almost endless desires cannot be satisfied instantly in real life. Desires that are unsatisfied in real life can be psychologically satisfied in dreams and adjust our psychological balance. Although we may dream of flying in the sky or losing ourselves in wonderlands, these glorious barriers are actually not as abstract as people think. For example, if a person encounters misfortune in their waking life, they may have dreamy dreams of happiness are used as compensations so their spirit will not fall into despair. In another case, successful people may also dream of failure or are unable to make up for the feeling of power and strength. Jung also suggested that dreams could represent underdeveloped sections of our character as well. This is the reason why some people's dreams' behaviors are obviously different from the behaviors and conditions in waking life. In concludes, dream is the sub-product of our imaginative powers, physically, psychologically, and mentally. From our sleep, it happens at any moments and in several ways. There were several integration and form of dreams. Dream explain those curious about it, scientifically, rationally, and verbally. We have the impressions that there was a pattern to follow in order to arrive at the explanation of dreams through vivid image and brain waves. The truth is that the brain penetrates and absorbs all, and dreams become its tooth is supported by all the ideas that have been clarified and studied by many researchers. That's all for me. Thank you.